Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a simple video using the video editor that's built right into Windows 10 that you might be overlooking. And I'm going to show you my favorite feature for students using the video editor. Let's go ahead and take a look here. So you'll find this by opening up the Photos option in Windows 10 and then selecting Video Editor. Let's go to New Video Project. Let's call this one Animals of Maine. So I'm going to name my video Animals of Maine. And the first thing I want to do is add some resources into my project library. Now I can do this by uploading pictures from my computer, pulling pictures from previous collections that I've made, or by searching the web. And this is my favorite option for students. They can go to From the Web. And this is going to search Bing Images. Let's say I need a picture of a moose. You'll see here, I have it selected for Creative Commons only. And when I hover over the bottom right corner of the picture, there's an option for more information and actions that will show me the link to the original image source. I'm going to select that one and insert it into my project library. Now let's do that again. I want to add another picture from the web. This time I want a picture of a puffin. And there's a picture that I like. So let's use that one. And again, insert it. And let's add one more. And this time I'd like to get a picture of a black bear. And again, as I hover over the bottom right corner of the image, I can look at more information and, and actions, and I can see the image source right there. So I'm going to use that one, insert it into my collection. So this collection will be a part of my project. And then I can use that to make my video. So now that my pictures are in my project library, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a title card for my little video that I'm making. Select Add Title Card, then select Text. And we can write in the text that we want to have appear on the screen. Do that right up here. Let's say Animals of main and I can choose the type of text that I want you can see this quiet one and I can choose the layout down here and then when I'm happy with it I'll just click done now if I want to change the background color for this title slide just click on background and I want to use this nice brown color they call it camouflage I'm going to use that one and add that in. And now I want to change the duration of the title slide. Let's change the duration. I only want it to play for 1.5 seconds. And there it is. Now I have just 1.5 seconds of my title slide. You can play that just like that. Now, let's go ahead and add all three of these pictures into the storyboard. So let's click and select them, place in storyboard. Now I want to point out one of the things that I really like about this is all those pictures have captions across the bottom that include the source of the image. You can see licensed under a Creative Commons license there with the link to the original image source. Now I can adjust the duration for all of these. So let's make this one here be, let's say four seconds. 
And we now have that for second piece. Now, what I want to add on top of this is this neat little feature called 3D effects. And 3D effects, we have all kinds of different effects we can do, like balloons or butterflies or autumn leaves. Let's do some autumn leaves. Let's add those in. And now let's play those autumn leaves. And so let's go back to that moose picture and play from the beginning with Animals of Maine. And we can adjust the playback of those 3D effects. Again, we have Autumn Leaves selected. And we can drag out the autumn leaves there to be the entire length. We can adjust the volume of the sound effect that comes along with those autumn leaves as well. Let's click done and add those back in. Now we can do those for every single one of the pictures that are in my video. We also have some filters here that we can apply, much like Instagram filters. We can apply those various filters there. And finally, in the upper right corner, we have the option for background music. And we can upload our own, we can select our own background music, or we can do custom audio and upload our own audio here. Upload my own audio file if I want to include narration or music to play throughout my entire video. When I'm happy with my video, let's go ahead and hit finish. And we'll export that video. My Animals of Maine video file and save it on my desktop. And then we can play it right back on my desktop. And once I've saved it, of course, I can put it on YouTube or upload it to OneDrive or put it anywhere else I would normally want to share a video. So there's my Animals of Maine video right here. Let's go ahead and play it. And this part here, we have not added any effects or audio to, but you do see all the image credits appear right at the bottom of the screen. So that's how you can create a simple video using the video editor. It's built right into Windows 10. As always, for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.